Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, um, if you haven't done so before, please comment, like, and subscribe. I post every Tuesday, so you'll have new content every Tuesday. And turn on your notifications so you don't miss anything. So I'm gonna get right into this video. We already checked in. We um, checked in a bag. Now we're just waiting at the gate. The airport's pretty empty. Literally. Literally empty. There's like the people that are supposed to like be up there aren't even there. So in the meantime, I got Starbucks. They just dropped this. Um, oat milk iced coffee i have been obsessed with oat milk for like about like five or six months now like i won't go back to regular milk so i've been drinking this i love oat milk and then they dropped well i don't know if they dropped but i got this um plant-based sandwich fire mm. Mm. see they're so good do not sleep on that oat milk iced coffee don't sleep on oat milk in general oat milk is so good oat milk makes coffee taste so much better like I'm not a coffee drinker but I do use it for energy as everybody else, but that is so fire. So it's like I, they just like release it. And I normally use at Publix, they have like the Chaboni, Chaboni, Chablong. You know that, that yogurt brand, Chaboni? I don't know what it's called. I don't want to say that. They have that at Publix oat milk plain that's the one i use in my coffee every morning yeah. i'm just trying to put you guys on don't sleep on that so that shit's so good um so let me do an outfit check real quick oh hold on all right so let me do a quick outfit check for you guys so i just dropped a jewelry line it's not officially out. I'm still waiting for all the merch to get in. But I do have a couple in so far. So I do have this ring. Look how cute this ring is. So it is one of those rings that you just put like above the knuckle. So I decided to put it on my middle finger. I'll probably put it on my pointer in a little bit. And it also has where you can adjust the um, width of your ring. So if you do have a smaller finger or a bigger finger, and you want to slide it all the way down here you can more than welcome do that i have this hazmat necklace look how cute this is so i do have these in silver and gold as well with the rings you can get this in either silver or you can get this in gold so make sure you follow me on social media so you can purchase these rings or this necklace i do have a lot more stuff so if you want to check out what else i have go on nara v jewels um, on Instagram and then my website is Nara V Jewels as well so you can check that out I will be announcing a release date so right now I'm still trying to get everything in before I release things because I don't want to be that person that has like just a couple of things on my website so once everything comes in I will announce that officially but I have been posting a few clips and a few pictures of like a lot of merch that i'm getting in a lot of jewelry that i'm getting in and you guys have been loving like what i'm bringing in so i'm so excited to um really i'm um, so excited to open this business and i hope you guys support me and for those who do support me thank you so much so once everything comes in i will do um a launch and hopefully you know you guys like the jewelry i love this necklace so like i said I have this one in silver and gold as well with the rings so I do have a lot more things coming in and a lot of things I do have in either um, silver or gold because you know everybody's that type of person everybody either loves silver or they love gold or they love both I love both so um, this is all I got in for now 
I do have a cross necklace that I will be wearing in my vlog maybe either later on today or tomorrow and you guys can see that I also got that in and that one as well I got in either silver or gold so that's all for now guys I will come back on this vlog when we land and I'll probably do my hair and I'll put on my lashes on the plane I always do that oh but outfit check so I got my jewelry on I got this um, black sweater it's like a, a little bit above the hips from Fashion Nova I got these cool like snake like pants they're kind of like legging materials but like not legging materials from Pretty Little Thing and then my shoes are obviously Nike Jordan I think they're called the Royal Blues I'm not sure but I will put everything in the link in the bio below if you guys are interested and then I did my makeup last night so that I could wake up like 15 minutes just get dressed take a quick shower and then come to the airport so I did do my makeup last night so this I slept with but I didn't put on my lashes but like I said I will put on my lashes for on the plane so when I land I'll get back with this vlog. Thank you guys. All right, we just landed in New York. We landed in um, at JFK, and and we got our rental. So now we're just driving to Jersey. Um, the weather is it's not that cold roughly in the um, low 40s but tonight it's gonna be in the 20s but yeah there's no snow on the ground um, we came in December and it was snowing almost every day but not now there ain't no snow so yeah so once we get to Jersey we're gonna go eat some Colombian food and I will record that so you guys can see like the really good pastries that we get. So yeah. So we're in Hackensack, New Jersey, and we pulled up to this Colombian spot. We're gonna eat it here. It's super cold, but we're literally just going in and out. But we're gonna eat something. Shut the fire. Oh, are you pastries? All right, guys. So I got a colombiana an arepa con queso. This has. This has spinach and cheese in it, um, salchicha, y pan de horno, y empanada de um, pollo. And I'm guessing, oh, that's mayo quechu. And these are some, maybe some spicy sauces. And that's milo, which is a Colombian chocolate milk, really fire. So I can't freaking wait to dig in. It's really, really good. So there's like a little bit of snow, but other than that, it's like melted. So like you see here, there's no snow here, but there is snow over there. Okay, so we parked our car. Now we are going to um, Museum of Sex. It's a mile walk from where we parked our car. Ooh, it's getting a little cold. But yeah, it's pretty cool. It was a total of $63, which is actually really not bad. So yeah, when we get there, I will record it for you guys, but it's the view. This is a 
super fun damn tunnel. And we stick our head in this thing. So they have um, this little carnival thing here that you prepay for it. It's super cool. Like, look at this. So it's pretty cool. We got little games right here. And then this game that we're going to play right here next. Brooklyn Museum and they have a cause exhibit there that just opened so I can't wait to see that also I don't know if we're gonna have time today maybe we'll do it on Sunday for my part two um, New York trip but they have a cause statue at the Seagram building and they also have another cause statue I not sure where on the top of my head but I'll put it somewhere on the screen when I get the answer for you guys but yeah I fuck the cause it's super cool super dope I uh, follow them on Instagram I love everything about it when I get my crib when we get our crib we'll definitely have cause all over the place so that's where we're gonna go right now and I'll if I'm allowed I will definitely record for you guys we just got in Brooklyn so yeah So for obvious reasons, I couldn't record inside of the museum, but if you follow me on TikTok, I did make a pretty cool TikTok of the whole entire museum. Uh, we were gonna buy merch, but everything was sold out. Not even a tote was available. So I was trying to buy a shirt, the figurines sold out. Everything was sold out. This must be the last day. I'm not sure. I don't know. We didn't ask, but everything is sold out. So we couldn't buy nothing. Um, so that's that. But like I said, follow me on TikTok and I, you will see pretty much the whole museum. I made sure I got everything that was important. So now the last time we were here was in December and I've been following this page on Instagram. It's called Public Harlem. I'll add their, um, sorry, it's called Harlem Public. I'll add their Instagram in the description box below. Like, check out their feed. This shit is fire. Like, their food looks so amazing. My best friend, she's been there before. She said it was great. It's like a must go. So now that we're finally back in New York, we're going all the way to um, Harlem Public on Broadway. I think it's in Uptown, not too sure. I'll let you guys know for sure if it's in Uptown or if, I don't think it's in Harlem though, but I think it is in Uptown. So we're gonna go there, already placed my order. And once I get the food, I will be back and show you guys how fire this food is. And I will tell you if it's worth it and if it's not worth it, but it's def it should be worth it. Like I've been following this page for a minute because their food just looks so good. So I can't wait to try it. And yeah, so as soon as we get it, I will show you guys everything. Okay, so we got tater tots, um, a peanut butter and peanut butter burger. So there's peanut butter sauce on there, fries, Dorito chicken quesadillas with sour cream, and this is a chorizo mac and cheese. So that's what we about to eat. I can't wait to dig in. Fire. 